Good morning everyone. The verse for today is taken from the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 11 verse 5. Just as you cannot understand the path of the wind or the mystery of a tiny baby growing in a mother's womb, so you cannot understand the activity of God who does all things. Amen. Just staying on the thought of God being a creator, how we need to trust him. I uh, came across this verse this week and it uh, again uh, taught me about the things that God does and how his ways, his thoughts, his activities are different, far more greater than you or I could ever comprehend. You know, the um, Solomon who was considered to be the most uh, wise man on earth, who was inspired by the Holy Spirit, penned these words and he said, you know, we cannot understand where the wind comes from or where it goes. We will never be able to understand the beauty, the, the, the sort of mystery of a child growing in a mother's womb. So forget about trying to, uh, you know, make out what God is doing in our lives. You know, I have been through situations where I'm wondering and having questions and, uh, you know, thinking why uh, there is a delay, why there are things happening in such a such a way and you look around in the world and there's so many questions that come to mind in terms of why people suffer so on and so forth but this morning i just want us to fix our eyes on this one thing that our god is creator god he has you know found the you know he found the universe he made the universe he, he established the foundations of the earth and he has got our lives you know beautifully charted out and all the word of God says is that he knows every step we take so as long as we uh, trust him and look to him we can never go wrong and even if we don't understand we just have to rely just as a child relies on the dad or the mom to help them cross the road we need to rely on God to help us cross any difficulties so, you know go through our day-to-day -day journeys you know in uh, recently again in ucb i uh, word for today it reminded me how when we pray to god we need to trust that he is you know with us he will certainly answer our prayers as god's children we have been given the name of jesus yes we can trust for him to answer our prayers but not at our, in our timing or in the way we would like it but we can trust him to deliver us and honor us because we are his children and uh, you know what uh, is uh, bothering us bothers him too so i just want to draw encouragement this morning from the fact that god is creator god i don't have to understand how he acts i just simply need to know and believe that he is creator god he can just create any uh you know way he can take away any blocks he can lead us so beautifully just as he did the Israelites over the, the wilderness for those 40 years and brought them to the promised land, just as he said, Amen. Let us pray. Our loving Heavenly Father, thank you for this beautiful morning. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Father, you are so, uh, Lord, beautiful. You are, Father, your ways and your thoughts are so majestic and magnificent. Even though we might not understand the path we are going, we thank you that your word is a lamp to our feet and a light unto our path. And we don't have to be afraid. We just need to put our hands in yours and stay and feel and know that we are safe in Jesus' name. Amen.